Hi. Here we are. <laughs> Whoa. <laughs> I've been planning that. Sorry. Um, <laughs> yeah. Welcome to the Trove live stream. Dev live stream, even yes. everyone. Hello. Hello. Hi guys. Who do we who do we see in chat? Who do we know? Hmm. Ooh, we need like a magic mirror. Yeah. Uh, Chronozilla. We've seen Chronozilla. See Chronozilla. Around. Sir Bonnet has asked us about Brazilians in the past. <laughs> nice. I Phantom always does that emoji. Gildador. Gildador, man. Classic Gildador. Gildador. Yeah. Gildador. He's been around a while. He's Hi, everybody. I am back. Zephyr Shock. <laughs> yep, back from Germany. Back from Germany and soon to go to Seattle. We are going to be. We'll start there. Sure, yes. Um, the three of us, among other Triumph people, but for Trove, the three of us are going to be uh, PAX in Seattle. Um, I actually know where we're going to be now. Booth 117 on the fourth floor. Uh, we are going to have Trove swag. Um, we don't have it here, but we're going to have some like Trove branded sunglasses. Uh, I think some I other think stuff. Um, I even so, have magic carpet uh, cards. That I oh yeah, we've yeah. got you some do? carpet yeah. coats. If you need, if you just never want a carpet coat <laughs> here, you can come get one from us. We'll take selfies wearing the shades with you. Um, we will. That's a trove. <laughs> yes, will. we will. Selfie. We will. Oh my God. Um, it's gonna be a lot of fun. Um, yeah. And we're gonna we're gonna like we want to start informally asking people what they want to see in the next class. I know we're just releasing this one. We're gonna show you today. Um, but you know, feel free to talk to us. Yeah. yeah. Class ideas. Um, if you're gonna be at PAX, if you're in Seattle. Yeah. Um, so we we may try to do something if you're just in Seattle but not going to PAX. We may try to do something one evening. I'll let you guys know um, if we figure something out. Like um, a trove thing. Just sort of just troving it up, you know, like sit down at a place, be all trovey. Um, <laughs> I was told to bring my special headgear. I've been slacking. <laughs> oh, on those. Yeah. Yeah. Um, got it. So maybe you, maybe maybe you wear pat ears. Like yeah, I uh, have been. You heard it here first. <laughs> Okay. Last year it was, was the devil here. ears. We had those like, um, light up devilian ears last year. It was great. Oh, all right. Um, gotcha. Gotcha. Secret message. <laughs> uh, you guys can't see. All right. Uh, well, it. we'll go to the big screen. Um, you guys already saw it last week. They spoiled everything. Yeah. It's weird. actually on PTS right now. Um, Don Tamer's a little bugged on PTS. It's PTS is for. It's called the public. It's you. Test. Because there's bugs. Server. Eh, it's a server. <laughs> Test um, equals bugs. Not pinata server. So, Down Tamer is Sherman Pig. It is on the PTS right now. There's definitely some bugs with it. We are going to fix them in like an hour or two. Um, that sh should be in pretty good shape to check out. Um, we will probably bring the server down sometime tomorrow, um, either tonight or tomorrow. So check it out basically today if you want to. Um, Mystic, yes. Um, those That feedback has been read. Um, and those bugs should be fixed. If they're not, please check it out again. Um, we got a lot of fixes going in from yesterday. Yeah. Um, they'll go in an hour or two. Um, they are not in here right now. We're seeing some bugs right now. Like the yeah, fact that this is this is a server from last night. Yeah. Um, we got a lot of bugs fixed this morning um, that we're uh, patching. Um, but okay, anyway, so we can sort of show it off. I can, yeah, you want to you just give it a quick, yep. for people who were here last week? Or? So I can hold down my uh, right click to charge up this net, and the longer it charges, the bigger it gets, and the longer it stays, which is great. You can trap all the mobs when you throw it. See how he's green, and it causes a dot on him. And if I shoot, I think my uh, damage actually yeah, it, it refreshes, refreshes it. it refreshes yeah, I wasn't it shooting there, I was just showing it off. <laughs> and then uh, also, when I kill mobs that are netted, I get uh, I get like a meat that I can throw out, yeah. which attracts As long them. as it's dotted. Yeah, a little friendly pet here, who this one has actually stunned that guy right there. That's pretty cool. Friendly to you. Friendly. And then uh, right now, they aren't they aren't moving, but they will uh, once we fix that. <laughs> Oh, I almost showed off the mount. You just did. I just did. A little sneak preview. It's it's muscle memory. I can't not mount after I kill something. <laughs> anyway, so yeah, it's kind of this class in a nutshell. It's got a fun synergy, yeah. I think. Well, you got to get an alt, man. You well, cannot alt. that's true. There is an alt form that basically uh, makes your makes your uh, attacks more powerful. And he rides a dino, and he shoots uh, little acid spits as dinos do. Yeah, no, <laughs> some really of them do. Classic dino. Sure. Yeah, you know, dino. <laughs> All right, I just lost the ult again, but I recharge like your producer message, Ted. Uh oh, project. Um, project your voice, Ted. Sorry. Sorry. <laughs> uh, if you want to gun on the last stream, you didn't get the code. Um, I know I saw in our live stream chat that they were checking on, on that for you. So, um, Deb, Deb the magical is on it. Um, yeah, we'll get it to you today. Who? Um, that was the, the person who last time. Oh yeah. Yeah, he did. You didn't get his code? Uh, we'll get, we'll get uh, you. Uh, you you checked your we Twitch you. inboxes. You're, you're you're in good hands. All right. Or at least hands. Hand. Hand. No, she's got two hands. She's got two hands, yeah. That's that check. Um, <laughs> the Dino Tamer class gem will change. Um, sir, but I, uh, go ahead and throw that feedback in the forum, on the forum thread. Um, that's generally where our class designer is looking for feedback. Um, 
<laughs> no, there's just a bug with the damage numbers. This is our look. We're right now on our dev build, which is the most buggy place to ever play the game, and you guys never get to see it for that reason. Um, <laughs> we're on it, though, because it has all the recent stuff that we want to show. So that's why the numbers yeah, are doing, zero. Yeah, I'm doing zero, zero, zero damage. Awesome. Take me from over there. Get dragonfly rage. Yeah. Here, have some meat. Brassy, in fact, is going to say if you do not message her now. Oh, message her now. She'll get it for you. Um... Who what? And I think she's yeah. She's also gonna be a Pax. So if you wanna if you wanna meet, uh, Linda aka Brassy. Is that a Brassy Borsi? I know. Uh, Brassy. Yeah, I think it's brass. Like, it's just oh, brass. It's brass. Brass. Uh, it's brass. Okay. Wow. I like oh, brassy. Embarrassing for me. <laughs> uh, <laughs> I like brassy. <laughs> me too. Uh, that's how I said it in my mind. That's I just always read it. Um, she'll be there too. A lot of fun. Um, maybe she'll also take a selfie with the trope shades. I don't know. I don't oh, want to yeah. promise anything. I'm just saying I will. Uh, okay, so this is the class, and it's got the ultimate. But now Ted's also showing the llama. So next week's <laughs> chest, we haven't we haven't put anything new in a cast chest for a while. Um, next week's cast chest will have the llama in it. Yeah, uh, the zero damage. If you're still asking about that, that is because we are on an internal server that has some bugs. It's a bug. It's Don't a worry bug. About it. Yeah, llama. The llama. So we we showed oh, this off weeks ago. It's it picks up your hairstyle, which is a ton of fun. <laughs> um, I'm really looking forward. I know Malambit had some mods. There's some mods out there for this guy. Um, and we'll, we'll obviously add some more llamas because, you know, you it's can't have just one llama in a game. Um, but this will be, so save your cast chests if that's your deal. Um, this guy's going to be showing up. What's oh, the name of this llama? Harry Larry. This is Harry Larry. Larry. But you see, it's Larry with two L's. Because it? It's a llama. It's a llama. Uh, Harry Larry. Harry, Harry Larry. Larry. Harry Larry. Um, the, the run cycle's so good, Robin. Every, everything. <laughs> it's just like, I love it. Uh, it needs some sunglasses. It's the Thug Life Every Day yeah. song. <laughs> no, I'm serious. That's where I got the it, reference It times from. to that pretty well, yeah. Sorry. Um, <laughs> I will answer your question, Hypercarry WP, in just a little bit. Um, I want to talk about a few things, actually. Just, you know, points of order, about Trove in general. Um, I will also say the launch of the Dino Tamer. So the Dino Tamer is on PTS right now. Um, Ted, in a moment, once you're done fighting off these... Trogs. Trogs. Frogs. Frog trogs. Frog trogs. These guys are not coming out. Oh, I wasted For the a net. the new dino biome, which is, you know, I'm going to talk about how we're going to release the dino tamer and how we're going to release the dino biome as well. Okay, I'm done. All right, you trogs. did it? You I did it. You did it. You All right. I, did. I know if creators want to make dungeons, the block should be going up on PTS today as well. Yes. Um, right, so you want to open the store for me. Open our dino tamer pack. So as we do, when we release a new class, we are putting out the prehistoric, prehistoric pack. Um... It is going to has a, I'll answer your question too, man. Um, <laughs> so uh, it comes with the Dino Tamer class, both of the initial costumes, the Jurassic Jungler and Road Wrangler, um, three class gem keys because you got to get the class gem for it if you want to. Um, the Lazera tops, which we haven't shown yet on the stream, we've been making some changes to it. So let's show that guy again. All right. Um, and the two Bino, Dino Biome Terraformers for your Club World. You know, just, you just want to terraform it up. Um, Bino Diome? Bino Diome. Yeah, Bino Diome. You know, yeah, it is Bino Diome. Yeah, for, it's for people who don't know, movie. the Dino Biome is, is basically <laughs> two biomes put together. We have the Saurian Swamp over here, which is swampy uh, for obvious reasons. And then over here we have this sort of tree canopy area, which is, do you remember, is it the something jungle? No, preserve? Jurassic, Jurassic Jungle. jungle. Jurassic, Jurassic Jungle. jungle. Okay. Yeah. I think uh, under the canopy there aren't cornerstones. Plots, correct? I, th there, I think there are. They poke are through they? the top of the canopy, kind of like how oh, this okay. recipe layer pokes cool. through. Um, but I'm not sure. I feel like they're yeah, less common underneath. I think they are, actually. That might be true. They, they might not have, yeah. have it. But it's also where the T-Rex lives. Yeah. Oh, you mean like that one mm -hmm. right there? Those guys mm -hmm. drop loot. Defeat a T-Rex, you get some loot. Shelby they're trying. auto bosses. Uh, throw your pet at it. Um, ah, right. You so, saw me. <laughs> uh, so the way we're launching this class um, is we are putting the pack out early. Um, you can get early access to the Dino Tamer alone. We're not doing the biomes. Um, but the pack will go out, and you can play the class. Um, and that will be going live. Our plan is for next week, unless we come up with something on PTS that is totally broken, um, we will be launching it. And then two weeks after that, it will be available on the store for individual. It will be available for class coins, uh, all those different ways. Um, so basically, you know, as usual, support Trove. Um, we want to give you access a bit earlier to just the class. Um, and then we will have the full Dino release coming out. Um, a couple weeks after that. We'll put that on PTS as well, and you guys will be able to check it out there. Um, yeah, so that's... Bird trog just hanging out on the, on the canopy. <laughs> what is a bird trog? This is maybe the most new NPCs we've ever made, I think. 
I think it might be, yeah. Yeah, we like, made, made about like nine of them. Yeah. Um, so check it out on PTS. Um, bugs should be fixed. I'm taking your guys' feedback. Um, and yeah. I actually also want to talk a bit about um, kind of patch cadence in general on Trove. So if you're here, you're probably kind of hardcore with Trove, and you know that we update once every Tuesday. Um, you also know that recently uh, we've had, uh, had some bugs. Um, some bugs have hit live. So we actually want to do a few changes. Um, we're going to be reducing the number of patches we do. So we're going to do the same amount of work. We always do. Uh, but we're actually going to patch only every other week. Um, we've actually added recently the ability to run what we call, you know, events. Um, those things that show up on the welcome screen, bonus experience, bonus loot, stuff like that. Um, and so we're going to be able to cycle events without patching. We're going to be able to run game sales without patching, stuff like that. Um, so our patches are going to get small, are going to get bigger, um, but happen less often. Um, and then we're going to run game events and stuff like that in between. Um, so we want to keep the game basically a lot more stable for you guys. Um, make sure we don't introduce new bugs to the game. Um, meanwhile, run really cool events. And so things like re-rolling the second stat on gear uh, could be a type of event as well we'd run. Um, I know you guys have asked about that. Um, our goal for that is to bring it by the end of next month. We want to introduce that event. Um, and we're going to work on some more. So if you have any good ideas for events we should run, double fishing example, um, feel free to throw them at us. And we're going to start adding those and introducing those. Yeah. 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 I got yeah. a bunch of like little little things today. Oh yeah. Um, the other the other big question you guys have asked. Yes, diamond dragon eggs are too random to acquire. Um, we do agree. Um, we are working on a design for how to sort of acquire them over time, um, especially for kind of an end game gameplay activity. Um, they are also you might have noticed not able to be deconstructed. That is for a reason. That is because there might be more things to get for them. Um, so we will be doing a release with those. There's also some really cool other dragon stuff. Um, that's going to be coming out. So, yes, I will give you more details very soon. Um, that is on the way. Uh, we've heard you on that. Um, we are working on a plan for that to be happening as well. Plans are being hatched. Yes. Hatched. Is that, hatched. Is that a pun? I don't know. Oh, yeah, you got to show sure. those Zeratops. Yeah, it is. So, um, we made some changes to this guy. We wanted him to be actually kind of good for builders and destroyers. Um, <laughs> Which isn't to say the laser is not strong. It does actually now scale off your damage stat. Whatever your largest damage stat is, spell or physical, it will, it will pick that up. Um, it also destroys blocks and it shoots faster than it did before. <laughs> it's pretty much awesome. It's right? pretty powerful against yeah. mobs too. But I can still like kill a motherfucker if I don't shoot this guy. <laughs> get off of me! I just get away from. Him. Anyway, yeah, Kitsi uh, put in some great VFX. I love the little beam going back and forth on the visor. <laughs> <laughs> oh man. Yeah. It's a pretty good one. Needs to be on a T Rex too. Just well, yeah. Yeah. That's pretty cool. Yeah. Uh, and I'm going to pick up some questions in chat. I know we have other questions as well. We um, Naughty Lal asks uh, Are you guys planning on having an event where you can swap stats on gems and gear? We do have a plan to allow you to modify um, at least one stat per gem. It is a kind of farther future plan. Um, but it's some kind, it's an additional kind of progression we'd like to add for gems. The ability to sort of uh, upgrade them a bit further by maximizing the stats on them. So um, don't expect it anytime very soon. Um, but that is something that we're looking at adding a way to do. It might be some kind of rare drop you can get that lets you, you know, um, modify a specific stat. I have a bunch of these questions. You want me to start chipping away? Uh, yeah, give, give me just one sec on okay. chat. Um, Kronozilla says, who do I need to pester for a dice recipe card? I really want them in the return has been promised for a while now. So my thinking right now with that is that we actually add them to the random recipe unlocker. So if you have all recipes in the game and you get a random recipe unlocker, it can actually um, potentially unlock one of the dice. Um, let, me, let me make a note, because I kind of want to do that for a little while. It won't be that hard for me to set up. Awesome. <laughs> that's, awesome. You, don't believe, you can't believe that's You think that's far. It used to be able to shoot, like, <laughs> yeah. visible distance. We oh, did man. have to bring it down a little bit. Um, <laughs> iPhantom asks, uh, able to talk more about the multi-core multi-threading? Yes, we're getting a lot closer. Um, right now it's pretty solid on DirectX, OpenGL. We're still fixing a few things with it. It is, like, for us, it's, we've actually been able to kind of test it a little bit on live. It's, it's there. Um, it's one of the reasons we've actually run into some of these recent bugs is because we were updating our third-party software to be able to run it. We've been doing some other internal core game changes. Um, it will be available in a beta state for you guys, I will say, relatively soon. Um, I don't want to promise anything yet, obviously. Um, but as soon as we can, we're going like, to let you guys basically use it on live, opt into it, uh, and give us some feedback on it. 
Do we have an update on the Club 2.0? Club 2.0, that is a great question. So, um, I will say they're related to some of these other changes. We're actually going to delay it. Um, yeah. We want to get a lot of things a little more stable. We want to do some more polish. Um, a lot of the core features are there. Um, things, for example, like customizing club ranks are sort of there from a tech point of view. Um, they need some UI, they need some other work. Um, we are going to delay it a bit. Um, we're still going to be working on it. We're targeting this year for it. Um, but it is going to be a little further out than we were originally planning. Uh, crafting and gear overhauls were talked about with your interview with Fuzzy. Are we going to see those by the end of the year or 2017? Um, that will be next year. Um, we are going to look at early next year for those changes. It's something that we definitely see a lot of value in, um, but it is kind of a bigger change to the game. It's kind of adding in maybe an additional uber level, stuff like that. Um, things like ring crafting, things like uh, making sure drops and equipment drops are more exciting. Um, yeah, so I can't type right. Will we ever see a Radiant Ruins terraformer? Uh, uh, I mean, that kind of thing seems like it needs its own world. I don't know, like, because it would be ridiculous if you just made this is Sky one. Islands. Yeah, there's yeah. a similar one that someone asked about Everdark Terraformer. Just, you know, just saying. <laughs> Keep it special. Let's see. I keep um, hitting myself with the net, I think. Went yeah, we got to fix that. Yeah, it looks like that. Yeah. Any coming planned gem updates? New class gems, new gem abilities, new gem types. We have designs for at least one more class gem per class. Um... Yeah, so it's something we want to do, and um, I don't want to give any to you that either, but it is it is in a pipeline somewhere. Uh, a lot of people are asking about the Moon Silver themed costume when they will be released. <laughs> I don't know what you're talking about. Guys. I don't know. It's ridiculous. Yeah, it's those aren't also. in a game anywhere. No. No, not at all. How would you find out about That's those? Weird. Yeah, so I will talk briefly, briefly about data mining. Um, obviously, you guys can see things that are in our data files. Sometimes we put things in there that aren't really, that maybe we're experimenting with, that maybe won't come out for a while. Um, and we're going to sort of not really talk about that stuff too much if it's in there. So you're welcome to see it if it's in there. Like, we can't stop you from seeing things we put in there. But um, just because they're in there doesn't mean they're necessarily going to be live anytime super soon. Hmm. Oh, this is a good one. <laughs> when will Twixler's Griffin collection be made public? <laughs> This is a good one. Then why are you looking at me? Well, I thought you had a plan. I don't have a plan. Oh, well, uh... Oh, do I need... Gonna, I'll come up with a plan. Come on, give we'll it, come yeah, up with a plan. plan. You're, you're, uh, I think you're maybe I'll bring some to <laughs> PAX, give some out, and then um, afterwards have a plan. All right. That's, that sounds that's great. My plan. After PAX, there will be a plan. Um, there's a question, uh, producer question. Can Tryon Creators show Dino Tamer from PTS? Absolutely. Please show it off. In fact, um... Well, let me know if you want me to say anything more. Uh... Producer man, but otherwise, uh, yes, absolutely, please do. Uh, oh, build some hype. Recain asks, I'll trade you six Skondas for three dragon eggs. Deal? Is that the guy who. Sure. Yes. <laughs> That's who he hoards them. He's just, everyone needs a hobby. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I don't know, it's a pretty good deal. That is a pretty good deal. Uh, let's see. Uh, Shadowhunters ended up having insane attack speed. Would you consider making Candy Barbarian, Barbarian's gum drop to stack up to a degree on dropping to allow faster attack speed? Hmm. I guess comparing. Them. That is an interesting idea. So um, we are going to do another balance pass on our classes. Um, worth considering. I think there was some concern about the Lunar Lancer and the Bay Clash Gems as well. Mm. Kind of being yep. a lackluster. Yep. Yep. So that would we've, be... We've heard some of that. I've, yeah. I'm keeping a list. <laughs> Checking it twice. Uh. Are there any plans to adjust the XP gain this week to actually be just that and not XP gain since we started counting it? Uh, yeah. Oh, that's a good <laughs> question. So yeah, the X, as you might have noticed, the XP gain board is um, lifetime. Uh, we have a fix. Uh, it's going to go out next Tuesday. It will not take effect until the following week, so enjoy your free uh, loot chests for another week, uh, even after this one. Um, but then they will be fixed the following week. Um, where it will actually require that you earn that experience within the week to get the chests. Will there will something like a character profile page be added? Uh, I think an example would be people providing false information to get in higher level shadow towers. Uh, we've wanted to do an inspect for a while. I don't have really an ETA when we might do that, but the ability to sort of like link your loot and inspect other people, it's, mm -hmm. it's always fun. Um, and it's something that we've talked about that the game could use. Um, but yeah, no ETA right now. Should we do uh, some art stuff and then switch over to live? Sure. I can throw some pinatas. You wanna? Yeah, I was writing well, my special shirt today. Oh Already. yeah, you're doing the. Need to. I'm all confuzzled. Um, 
cool. It's fan art time. Oh, fan art time. And you can read the names. Uh, can I? Oh. So this yes. one is Inky. by Inky. They are. Dracolite. There. That's pretty. It is. Look at that evil Dragon eye. and uh, Dracolite, yeah. That's good. <laughs> All right. Cool. Next. Next. <laughs> Dracolite pet. Follow deer. Follow deer. Follow deer. Mm -hmm. That is. That's that's pretty cute. Let me get this. I, I, I know this yeah. artist got really excited to get my trophy once. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> well, aren't we all? I might PVP a little later work. today. So I know. All right. If you guys Maybe want another too. chance. Yeah. Oh, you are. Maybe. Oh man. I don't know. Next up is Hoonibold. <sighs> Hoonibold. I love this one. It's so cute. Little <laughs> it's happy face. Bouncing mushroom out. <laughs> Reminds me of my little screen chat feelings. Yeah. Yeah, that's pretty good. That's cool. All right. Next is Louis C. Dracolite. He doesn't need weapons. He uses his mind. <laughs> it's cute. He's explaining something. Yes. Yeah. Another Dracolite by Nerdy Pig. Ooh. Nerdy Pig. That's pretty. I liked uh, Nerdy Pig's Revenant. Do you remember that one? Yeah. <laughs> the Chester. Yeah. <laughs> I like the tail here. That's it's, amazing. It's nice. That's good. It's pretty subtle. Next is hey. Scottish Buckle. Nice. Awesome Boomer Ranger. Yeah, Boomer Ranger with I think a sword. I have, yeah, yeah, I have that sword. Yeah, it's a good mm -hmm. sword. All right. Scottish, oh, Scottish Buckle. Oh, like a Joker version. <laughs> we have that mask. Yes. That's pretty cool. Yeah, that's pretty cool. I Let's like see. it. This is also by Scottish Buckle, yes. Ooh. And this is Sky Whoa. of the Virus, Everdark. That is, that's like traditional paint right there. It is. Some oil. All the media. Nice. Medium. Did we ever open yeah. all those little things? I think we might still have a few did. more. Did we? Okay. Oh. The little package. I'll find that, out. Yeah. 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 Go open it up. Cute. And another Everdark by uh, yes. Synthium Stars. Yes. I like that moon. It's a desium. Mm -hmm. Yeah, that, that moon turned out. The river of spikes, too. It's Solid pretty creepy. Good. Yeah. It's this guy made that creepy. moon. I did make that moon. Yeah. <laughs> All right, and, and that that's is the loop. It's the loop. The, the loop. loop. The loop. Can we go to the uh, big screen? So I'll, I'll hop onto the regular game. Yeah. Yeah, a big screen. Big screen. Boom. Boom. Thank you again for everyone who gives us the fine art every week. I love it. Yeah, fine it's art. really a treat. To discover, oh, that's what I want. Want me to ask some more there? Sure. All right. Give me a question. We got lots. Uh, oh, I know this one's asked a lot. Are auto clickers illegal or not? <sighs> it's kind of one of those things we don't. Don't. Know. If you personally are clicking, it's making you click like it's like a macro on a mouse or something like that. You should be fine. Don't use third-party software, behind-the-scenes stuff. Don't have it play the game for you. Um, if you were using it to simply click faster, you should be fine. Again, you're getting kind of a gray area there. Um, but if it's something that someone could theoretically do themselves, you're fine. Um, someone's asking about TwitchCon. I don't know if we're talking about that yet. I know people around here have been talking about some things, but um, our community folks can probably share. I like this question. Mm -hmm. uh, would we add a limit of players that the Rally Blade would bring you to? For example, using okay. Rally Blade would bring you to four to five players in any given world, not to one that's already eight plus. Hmm. I actually experienced that quite a bit. You, you know, you want to join for a quick challenge, but then right. it's just a mob. Right, right. Uh, that is a good idea. Um, yeah, we should look into that. For Pearls of Wisdom, can they be added back to Shadowy Treasure Island merchants for a higher price of sale and a rare chance of being able to find Shadow Treasure merchants? That's kind of um, no plans right now. I think we are doing a few things to make them a little more common out of the places they come from right now, so the price should drop a little bit more. Um, but we're pretty content with where they are right now. Um, the time we might revisit is if we end up doing more with them in the game. We let them do more things. Uh, let's see, new adventure chest, question mark? Oh, could relate to your plan. Oh, wait, we weren't going to do that with them. No. Anyway, uh, we will, yes, we'll do another one in the future. Um, we're getting back into doing um, a little more community content. Um, Keetsy's been looking at some stuff. Um, she's been building some stuff. We got some community-made wings uh, coming out. Um, and so potentially, as part of what she's looking at, we could uh, do some more. Market asks, what will the crafting cost for Jurassic Jungle Terraformers be? Oh, that's good. I just looked at it yesterday. <laughs> uh, there's a new resource type, obviously, that comes from the uh, Jurassic Jungle. It's on top of the trees, um, or the, the tree canopy. Um, I know that goes into them, and uh, some other stuff. It's, it'll be on PTS uh, soon, um, once we put up all that stuff. Uh, I think starting next week. Uh, someone asked about weather terraformers for club sections. Still something we'd like to do, actually. Um, we're pretty close in terms of tech to being able to do that. Um, kind of changing rain, changing the different kind of weather in the area. 
Um, again, kind of when we get back to talking about the club update, um, I'd love to give you some more news. Will two and Razor healing not be nerfed in ultras? We still have our healing based on damage dealt, and the damage is reduced in there. Ooh, that's a good point. That actually, I've experienced that. That is an incredibly good point. Um, yes, let me look at that. Um, no ETA right now, as usual. I love saying that. Um, but that's a very good point. Let's see. Patron buff for legendary tomes. Maybe. Yeah. Um, I think Market had that question. Maybe that's his on there. Um, basically, the question is, hey, there's a lot of legendary tomes. It'd be great if there's a way to get a boost towards those tomes. Um, we agree. And uh, we'll see what we can do. The other thing, actually, if you've been holding on to your non-tradable class coins, we are going to make those turn into something uh, quite soon. The goal is to put that out um, next week as well, so keep an eye out for that. Oh, I should also mention, we've got a, a Saturday login bonus. I actually have to double check mm. the day. You get like 25 daily login chests, yeah. plus 10 jump for the day. What? Uh, That's what I'm playing. Bonus experience. Um, so make sure you log in. I know it's on the social media, um, exactly which Saturday that is, but... Um, community and marketing, they're like, let's do something amazing for a day. What can we do that's amazing? And so we figured some stuff out. This person built a giant replica of the guarding table. Oh, that's, oh, that's, that's awesome. actually pretty yeah, darn good. I did that in my club world too. It's a, uh, yeah, that's good. I like that. This one's a, maybe a better version even. <laughs> I think there's is better. There's is better. There's better. Mm -hmm. Sorry, Ted. That's okay. Uh, somebody asks, <laughs> more Shadow Tower rewards. Oh, uh, yeah. Like, you mean for the uh, souls? Yeah, right? Yeah, yeah. It's been a while. We've added those wings, and that was the last thing we added. Oh, I have an idea, but I'll... Okay, um... <laughs> Since the extra life pack was removed, will you be adding a way to obtain the Dusk Rider Dragoon Lunar Lancer costume? Because the pack was the only way to get it. That's a good point. Mm. Um, we're actually bringing back a lot of our packs. We're going to put them as rotating deals, so they'll show up every so often for you if you're still looking for some of that stuff. Um... I think that may be in that list. It'll be going live very soon. Um, so the old class pack, stuff like that, will just kind of rotate through. They're not going to clutter up the store, um, but they will be available if someone's looking for them. When can we expect Steam achievements? Um, let me grab one question here real quick. Hefesta asks, will the non-tradable class coin change be optional? It's optional. It'll be a thing you can deconstruct them for. So you can save them if you'd like, um, or you can turn them into a special new reward if you'd like. Oh, Your question was Steam uh, achievements? Yes, Steam achievements. Um, so we're looking at some Steam stuff. We're looking at achievements. Um, we're looking at some kind of the, the mod ability improvements, maybe uh, using Steam Workshop. Um, again, no ETA as usual, but we are doing achievements for consoles as well. And so we're seeing what we can do to, you know, kind of just put that on both places. I see a lot of questions about locking your cornerstone and not, so you don't accidentally bomb it. Yeah. I've seen <laughs> Is that something where... I've, I've, seen, it, I've seen a task made for that. <laughs> I love saying this stuff. You're just like, come on. <laughs> it's in there. It's in there. Um, as usual, we are, like I said before, um, right now we're going to refocus a little bit on game polish um, rather than new features, and, and that actually does fit within game polish in some way as well. Um, so we do want to make sure the game gets more stable from where it is right now. Um, we introduce fewer bugs, and we just really kind of polish things up. Um, so start looking for some of that in the near future here. Right. See. Are there ever be a new mastery cap? Yes. That yes. was actually. Insane. Oh, you were just about that. <laughs> yeah, I was. That's wow. I was reading it out of chat. I have chances. Uh, let's see. Are there plans to release the mounts in the battle arena pack to buy with the arena coins? Uh, the pack will be coming back to the store, like I just mentioned. Um, that will return. Um, that part. <laughs> you. Oh, I'm like trying to. You know, yeah, you're trying to parse that. Yeah. No, it's, it's all good. It's all good. Asks, will the Dino Tamer have a slash Pratt command which makes him enter this booth? I think he's Pratt is the kid from Jurassic Park, right? So it's no, like, oh, the new the Chris, Chris Pratt, Pratt is the Chris new. Pratt? It's, it's oh, like, I don't even know. I haven't seen the, it. We should, yeah, we should do it. It's like this. We could do it. <laughs> and then I mean, the Raptors like, are up there. It's it's classic Raptor oh, stopping. Oh yeah, that's oh, right. Where he's like pointing at his like, yeah. I still can. Okay. All right. Clearly, Maybe. clearly an oversight. Super. Um, how about jetpacks? Would be nice, especially for building the world. You don't have to jump all the time if you want to build something high. It has come up quite a bit. Um, it's something we do want to do. Uh, it, we need we need to build some technology to be able to be in a mounted state or an alternate state while in build mode. Um, so when we can do that, uh, it's something we'd like to offer. 
I'm gonna roll carpets. Oh, yeah, we gotta do rewards. That's why everyone's here. <laughs> we gave away a gondola last week. Oh, you, you, you that's, got what, that that's what happens when I'm not here. He um, and because we are at PAX next week, um, I actually am not sure who's going to be on the stream. We may end up not doing it. Um, we're going to figure out on, on the team if someone's comfortable uh, being here alone, and if we're comfortable <laughs> with them being here alone. Uh, so I think, yeah. I think... I think we'll do it. Uh, I'd love to do it. I think I, I think Noah can do it. This is a pinata. I think Noah, pit. Kita, and Kumar could do it. Yeah, we'll do it. Let's do it. I know. They're right? going to be here. We're going to do it next do week. It. We will be here entertaining you all. It'll be a simple stream, though. Nothing. Don't expect any spoilers, um, but expect a good time. And maybe a Gonda. Are you guys seeing this bouncy pit? This is pretty awesome. Whoa. Oh, I don't know if I'd go in there. I'd probably throw up. <laughs> I wish I could throw it's from fine. a. It's fine. Oh, yeah. No, I can't throw from a distance. Someone says they cry if there's yeah. no stream. I would too. All right, so I'm gonna roll ten carpets while they're he's yeah, bouncing keep... around, and then I'll read them off. <laughs> <laughs> I'm trying to pick a camera angle that's not gonna make people throw up. <laughs> this is this is good. We can do, we can do this. this I like it when the pets. Yeah, join it. it just the yeah. Best. When it gets crazy, it's pretty cool. <laughs> there might be some stragglers. Here. I think I've heard this one. It's amazing. This is so good. <laughs> <laughs> Are they even dying? Uh, I think so. Slowly, yeah. slowly. If you can aim. <laughs> so good. Oh, we shouldn't get one of them. I, well, I like that I roll in first, but I read now. So I don't get duped again. Oh, that's good. That's good. Yeah. Oh, Still getting over some jet lag from Germany. How was Germany? It was great. Cool. It was wonderful. It was, we saw some fans. Yeah, I saw you went to dinner with them. Uh, with had them. dinner, dinner, and they suggested the best burger place in Cologne. Oh, good. And it was. All right. As far as we know. I mean, we didn't go to all of them. <laughs> But we felt, so, alright, here, this is your fact of the week, since we enjoy our facts of the week. I love it. Um, we were really, really awkward because, you know, we're a bunch of Americans in a burger place, and every single person there is eating it with a knife and fork. Like, oh, that's they've awkful. got it on the table, and we're like, nope, we can't do that. <laughs> we cannot, we cannot pull out a knife and fork. We are going to go face, hands, and they were really messy, too. So we were just being really gross about it, but. <laughs> well, Germans, in theory, know how to eat hamburgers, right? Didn't they invent them? Do they, do it's they named cut after hamburger. Hand, yeah. And they, I, mean, I don't know if they swap. Wait, so, but so they, they're they, super fancy. They're like. Yeah, it's it was really fancy, <laughs> really refined. I Man, I'm bad. I, I just get pizza it. and I'm like in half and cows yeah. on it. So. Yeah. If I could just wad it up into good. a ball and shove it all in my mouth, I would. All so. right. So I'm gonna read the carpet winners. <laughs> There's ten of them. <laughs> uh, Ray Lay, Tony Berry X, Down with Vowels with No Vowels, <laughs> AT9, Techno Blitz, Nitronza. Nitronaza, uh, Banzer, Mr. Beastly B, um, Exoris1992, and the Meeper532. And I'll put those in chat. Awesome. Congrats, guys. Uh, Mike and DX asked a good question. I don't know if we've been able to address it on the stream yet. Um, he asked about why the increase in price for Brazilian users on Steam for PAX. Um, quite simply, um, there was someone who was using that reduced price to sell those codes globally. Um, so they were buying them cheaply and undercutting us, um, basically exploiting the system. Um, so we did have to disable it. Um, we really want to be able to bring it back for you guys in some way. Um, we're trying to figure out how we can do that, either through our in-game packs or through Glyph or through Steam. Um, we know that's something you guys want, um, and so we're going to be figuring that out. Want to throw a die? Sure. Who's going to do the not? spiel? Not it. I got this. <laughs> oh, I got to talk enough today already. Uh, so, uh, we do cast coins. Cast coins, if you win one, gives you a cast factor. Cast factor, every day you log in, gives you a cast chest. They're amazing. Um, we will give you four today. You, probably you, all of you. Um, four of them, plus whatever Ted rolls on this dice he Here is we about go. to throw. We're going to use some lava for good luck. Oh, uh, three. Three. <laughs> All right. Three. Seven coins. Yeah, three. Seven we, coins. And I'll three is something we can say with it. Yep. I'll roll seven and then I'll read them after. Get some pinatas back in here. 
Oh, no, we're missing my sound effects. Uh, we have no hats today, we have no sound effects. I know. I'm surprised anyone's still even here. Cactus team is asking me in-game to show the pinata cosplay from Trovasaurus. We will find that and and take a look at it, maybe make it into uh, the fan art. I haven't seen it yet. Fasty's seen it, apparently. There's a really cool pinata costume oh, for the Dino Tamer. Oh, I saw that last night. Yeah, I saw it, <laughs> and like, I just, I died. It was amazing. <laughs> Um. Oh, I'm gonna count. Sorry. Um, oh, I'm doing more again. Get in there. Get in there. Now we are. All right. Coin winners are X Bentu X, May Colin, Zephyr Shock, Manuel, Manuel R41, <laughs> uh, Money Face, and Leak Speak. Uh, sick Oz and your average gamer. Congrats, Congrats guys. Okay, that's going winners. And I'll put the chain. Oh, bam. Mm. 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 Yes. Nice. I think my coffee just kicked in. Cactus team says, follow me. All right, where are you, Cactus team? Follow me. <laughs> We're following you. He's got Someone's a asking about the kangaroo tamer. I heard about that. I haven't seen it yet, though. Um, I can't promise oh, we'll accept anything ever, but we'll definitely take a look, and if it's cool, that, sounds cool. That video, though, was amazing. I haven't seen it. <laughs> I've been it's out of the loop. Island. I've been out of the loop. All right, oh. if it's good, it's good. I think it's got apples. Apple-themed kangaroo? I need to look at it a little closer. Oh, yeah, it's, a uh, yeah, apple It was fuels. kind of like a... <laughs> Oh, awesome. I saw, I saw, you that, did. I saw the apple. I didn't see the, everything else. I just uh, saw the apple. You didn't see the video. Oh, okay. I didn't see anything. You, you made a great music. I saw the show shorts page. That's where the apple. <laughs> For good time, watch the video. For good time, watch the video. Okay. I see, I see some needs for griffins. Uh, uh, you see some griffin needs. Great. I think I will give away three of each. <laughs> you should just give it to your favorite people. Don't even uh, roll. All right, let's give some. That's right. Everyone's my favorite person. Oh, just give them to Ted. He needs some griffins. All right, he's the first person to give griffins. All right, I'm gonna roll for three polys, and then I'll read them out. Oh, that's not what I wanted. I'll read this. Mercer seventeen is asking. The chat is real. I know. Oh yeah. They're hard to get. Uh, Mercer seventeen is asking about a TDM PVP portal in spawn, like in the spawn. Robin's been pavilion. pushing for that. Oh, which what? Like oh, a TDM match. portal. So I think in the, spawn. the way we're gonna do it, we like having one kind of quick play. It keeps matches popping fast. Yeah, it keeps the people. Um, keeps gameplay active, but we might run an event, for example, where team death matches the PVP type. That would be great. I, I think, think that'd be awesome. Be awesome. Yeah. and maybe have double battle. Like some bonus, or bonus or something. Yeah, some or... bonus rewards. Yeah. Um, so again, we're really looking at adding kind of more events that we can run rather than again patching every week, um, and so that's that's the kind of thing that could definitely uh, end up being a, a type of event. All right. So our three Polly the Griffin winners are Cryptic Seven, Optimus Forty Eight, and Stormy Skull. Auctioneer says he's not the favorite. Aww. What? I didn't Auctioneer, you're my favorite. I still have Fal Falminar to roll here. I'm gonna do three of those. <laughs> I want to give away something cool too. You do? Uh -oh. I do. No Gondas. No Gondas. No, I don't give away Gondas. Yeah, Dismantle Time. I'm not that kind of person. I don't. No Gondas. What? Dismantle Time says Auctioneer, you're my favorite. So. Uh, I can see the streamer love, love there. To, yeah, yeah. A lot of good love. Um, what can I give away that's. <laughs> it's cool. not really crazy, but cool. Um, it's really crazy. This might be cool, Ted. It's really cool, like you guys. Last time, llama, but the llama's gonna just be out. Everyone's gonna be there. All right, all right. I'll tell you what. I'll tell you what. I'm gonna give away. I'm gonna give away. Since I won't get to do it next week, you're not gonna get them until next week. I'm gonna, I'm gonna leave Steve a little message, or that he's gonna get a message from this. I'm gonna give away three of the new Dino Tamer pack. So again, oh, you guys will get it. After they go live, I think I'm in chat. I want to give away the new pack. I'm hoping you guys not, got yeah. to see it today. Uh, yeah, yeah. Well, um, so three right. of those. So well, I'm gonna here, read you off, roll it for me. I'm gonna roll oh, you got, Falminar you first. Uh, three Falminar Griffin winners are Ramito, 
uh, hypnotize and yuck suck sus sus. I'm just gonna put it in chat. Because <laughs> <laughs> words are hard. It's got to be a lot of X's and Y's. On it. All right, Dino Tamer pack. Oh boy. Here we go. Yeah. First up is Sid. You can get to say it. I get to see it. Sebi says. I like his who icon. An art. Yeah, it's an art of the um, the Chaos Beastie. Ooh. The creepy nice. bird? Yeah, the creepy bird. Creepy bird. Next up. Maffy0303, that is. Awesome. Congrats. <laughs> and last I know pack winner is. Betulix. Betulix. Betulay. Betulay? <laughs> French. Uh, I'm sure at next week's stream they will give away some more. <laughs> you guys can let them know I said that. Um, congrats to the winners. That'll do it. Whole, oh, whoa, that world's incredible. Yeah, this is Edge of the Abyss again. Oh my god. Oh, this is from, we went here last week, right? Yeah. yeah. Uh, I, was, I saw epic. some cool new creator stuff too, and our, or, you know, world building stuff, but I can't talk about that today. Um, Secrets. 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 Oh, secrets. Oh. secrets. Um, oh, we're, we're getting down to the wire on time, actually. Oh, boy. Yeah, so we should probably consider who we're going to host. Um, will it be new fish for the dino biomes? That's a good question. Not yet. Mm. Uh, fishing will definitely get a pass. Um, maybe we'll add swamp fishing. I don't know. There's something people were interested in with that. I forget. You just catch frogs. But, oh, <laughs> that's fun. <gasps> Would it be easier to Throw a bomb. Frogs? And frogs pop out. Oh, triplets of Belleville, best movie ever. <laughs> <laughs> I love that scene. Yeah. It's, uh, it's classic. I'm trying to see if there's any other questions. You addressed them at New Mastery Cap, didn't you? Yeah. Uh, I did. I did say we, we have some plans for it, it'll go up another 100. Uh, it'll go up to 400 next time. Oh, boy. Um, we'll no longer to be maxed. We, uh, reach uh, it. All right. Uh, we've got a suggestion, which, hey, sounds good to me. Um, are you guys, have we hit it all? Have we done everything online we want to do? I think we did. Yeah, questions just, seem pretty good. We yeah, got most of the questions. As usual, we'll answer more. Um, we won't be here next week, so next week's just going to be a light, fun stream with some other people from our team. They'll do giveaways. They'll hang out. Um, probably won't answer a whole lot of questions, but if you have your own personal questions, we we will be at PAX. Um, so send your questions with someone who will be there. Be there yourself. Um, we'll have swag. We'll have uh, code giveaways for all of our games, which I we're not spoiling yet. Surprise codes. Um, the location is booth 117 on the fourth floor. Um, and we will totally, totally hang out with you. So I want to um, say, be there, be square. Oh. Oh, because it's true. Oh. Sorry. I had to. Oh. Oh, my God. Oh my God. <laughs> I'm super excited. Yeah, it's, it's going to be a lot of fun. Yeah. yeah. Um, I like PAX. PAX is fun. All right. well, I've great. actually never been. Well, let's go big. We'll say our goodbye. We're going to have fun. I know. And, um, yeah, guys, so thanks for being here. Um, again, stream next week. We'll be at PAX. And um, see you there. Happy Friday. Bye.